हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू स्टड आई टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस सम लोवियन कैलकुलेशन विच आर रिलेटेड टू द टेलीस्कोप सो इन द वीडियो वे आर आई हैव टोल्ड यू अबाउट हैंड हेल्ड टेलीस्कोप एंड आई हैव डिस्कस्ड ओवर देयर दैट देयर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ टेलीस्कोप एंड वट इज द पर्पज ऑफ टेलीस्कोप राइट सो फॉर द लोवियन पेशेंट्स वी इन्हांस देयर रेजिडुअल वियन राइट सो फॉर द इन्हांसमेंट ऑफ देयर रेजिडुअल वियन वी यूज डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ लोवियन एड्स एंड द टेलीस्कोप इज वन ऑफ दैम राइट सो वट इज द पर्पज ऑफ द टेलीस्कोप टेलीस्कोप हेल्प्स the patient to see the distant objects clearly with the minimum vision he has right so for the lovian patient telescope play an important role so if a patient comes to you and you know that he is a lovian patient or is in the category of lovian and you have to prescribe the lovian aid which includes the telescope for the clearance of the distance object so you need to prescribe the telescope of some specific magnification right for that purpose you should know the formula that how can you calculate the magnification of the telescope required for the specific patient so magnifications of the telescope depends on the real acuity or we refractive state of the patient right so over here we are going to discuss that how can we calculate the magnification of the telescope using the real acuity and how can we measure the magnification for the each patient so let's move on okay so here we got a case that if a patient comes to you with and he has a actual real acuity of about 6 by 60 and the desired distance real acuity means that the distance at which patient wants to read or you can say that the distance a patient says that i have the work at the specific distance or i want to see the objects at the specific distance but i am unable to see that so you know that you have used the snellen equity uh, snellen chart for these for the measurement of or for the evaluation of the refractive status of the patient eye so you came to know that patient is 6 by 60 at distance right so now you ask the patient that what is his requirement he tells you that i want to see the object at the distance of x y z meters right or he wants to see the 6 by 18 line at the 6 meter distance right so you came to know that the font size of the patient for the distance is 6 by 18 one right on the snellen chart so over here you noted that desired distance real acuity is 6 by 18 that means that at the distance of 6 meters patient wants to read the 6 by 18 letter right here you came to know that patient wants to see the distant object so telescope may be a good choice now after choosing the lovian aid you came you wanted to know that what should be the magnification of the telescope for that patient whose real acuity is 6 by 60 and wants to read the letter 6 by 18 so here you got a formula for the magnification of telescope magnification equals to desired real acuity divided by target real acuity so desired real acuity is 6 by 18 while actually 6 by 60 so you are going to divide both these real acuities and you will achieve the magnification of the telescope for this patient right so how you going to do this m equals to 6 by 18 which is which was the desired real acuity you are going to divide it with 6 by 60 so you are going to calculate it mathematically and you will obtain 3x so this means that for the patient who was having the actual distance real acuity that was 6 by 60 and was wishing to read the 6 by 18 letter should have the 3x magnification of the telescope in order to see this letter or to in order to see the 6 by 18 line i have discussed the training steps of the telescope and about a little bit 
introduction to the types of telescope and what is the handheld telescope in the another video and that the link will be in the description you can go and watch that video and then you can relate this with the example and you can understand that what is the handheld telescope what are the types and training steps and you can also know that how you can calculate the magnification of that telescope right so the magnification of telescope for this case will be 3x so this is how you can calculate the magnification of the telescope by using this simple formula and if you got this formula you can easily measure the calculations you can easily know that how or what magnification you can give to any kind of patient and these magnifications of the telescope may differ for every patient right according to their actual and according to the desired vl acuity so over here it is desired divided by actual vl acuity right so this is all about today's lecture it's a short video of how you can calculate the magnification of the telescope in case of any query you can comment in comment section and you can watch the video of the handheld telescope and their training steps the link will be in the description and don't forget to like subscribe and share it with your fellows Thank you so much.